The sunstones are fun, but I like fossils. I had been waiting all day for a chance to dig my own at a place called You Dig Fossils. This place is a quarry where you can dig to find ancient marine animals called trilobites. These prehistoric animals lived in this area when it was an inland sea. The reason this is such a hot spot for trilobites is this strata actually pops out of the ground here. The earth, the earth has thrust these layers up in this area and now they're exposed so we can get to them. This rock is mid-Cambrian. It's 550 million years old. Uh, there's not very many places in the world where you can find your own fossil trilobites. We went to see Bevan Hardy to learn what type of trilobites we could expect to find. Okay, now these are going to be the most common ones you find here. Now this is the Alrethia king eye, mm -hmm. and this is the Asophiscus wheelerii. Mm -hmm. He's bigger, he's very thin. And then we have the Paranopsis. He's the blind one, looks like a figure eight. And then we'll have a brachiopod. That's the first bivalve clamp. Okay. So, and that's it. You're ready to go. What I do is here, give you a hammer okay. and a bucket. There Great. you go, sir. There's your hammer and bucket. I think I'm and going to us. <laughs> good luck. Right. Have a, happy hunting. Thank, Thank you. you. I was so excited. I had dreams about doing this. I hoped I'd find something. There were rocks everywhere. It was hard to choose a place to start digging. My dad picked a place to get started. I couldn't believe I found a trilobite on my first try. Okay. There you go. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa, you did it. <gasps> There's one right here. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, right there. Lucky. <laughs> Same right here, here. Here it is, it popped right out. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. Pretty. It's actually got color to it. You're pretty darn good. After a great day of fossil hunting, we decided it was time to take a look at what we'd found. We compared all the trilobites that we found. It was amazing to think of these animals roaming the bottom of the seafloor millions of years ago. I could have stayed at this place for a week. What a fun experience. From the valley floor to the mountaintops, there are thousands of secrets to discover in the Great Basin area. I look forward to more discoveries as we continue on our adventures through wonders of the West.